name is Rich Hanlon. I'm your Wild Neighbors Nature Connection Nature Guide. It's 6.30 a.m. on March 16th. Spring, officially, is right around the corner. And I'm out back behind the house this morning, hoping that we can catch uh, a dawn chorus experience. I have my sitting mat, so we'll go perch ourselves on a log out here at the edge of the forest and see what happens. Today's dawn chorus experience may have felt more like a dawn solo, with the Dark Eyed Junko being the primary songster for us to appreciate. We did hear some distant songs of red-breasted nuthatches and black-capped chickadees. Didn't hear any singing robins this morning. I heard one yesterday, but not today. Uh, for a couple of reasons. One, it's a very overcast morning. Uh, Again, you can hear the, the rain, uh, the water uh, from the rain dripping from the trees. There's a thick fog blanketing the landscape, and that tends to subdue bird song any time of the year. As we progress into the springtime, we will see the dawn chorus heat up. <laughs> there will be more than one voice joining the chorus. And so we'll revisit this dawn chorus experience in weeks to come, and it'll be interesting to see how uh, different how and when different voices join in the chorus as we get closer to the breeding season of our feathered neighbors. Well, thank you for joining me at my sit spot this morning. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you next time.